Hello guys, this is Techmaster. So today I'm going to show you how you can install Intel graphic driver on your Windows 10 or Windows, Windows 7, Windows 11. So how to do it is it all work in the same way. So all you just need to do, pay attention and see how uh, we do this. So the first thing you need to do is to go and check this link. The all the links I will talk about will be in the description below if you want to check them. So this is the first link. So as you can see, this is the first link. Once you, once you click on the first link, it's going to open this. You are going to see Intel driver and support assistant. So what you have to do, make sure that the version of this Intel driver support assistance is on the latest version and scroll down here and click on download. So what we are doing, we are trying to install this Intel driver assistant on our computer so that it will help us to like update all the software we need on our computer every time there is a new version. So once you have installed this, then the next thing I'm going to show you is how you can install the Intel driver file. So how to install it, what you have to do, you can do it manually, but because we have installed this tool, which is this Intel driver um, and support assistant, it's going to help us to do everything. But let me say, for example, you want to do it manually. That is what I will show you first before we we'll come back and use this um, Intel uh, driver as, uh, assistant. So first thing let us install it manually first so if you want to install it manually click on the second link in the description and it will take you to this session so you will see a um, new Intel graphic driver for windows 10 and windows so that is it and just scroll down here select a bit of your uh, computer the bit of my computer is a uh, 32 and 64 that is what is showing here so i need to select the one for my uh that suit to my uh window so i will say okay i want to download this one which is for um 64 i will click on that so once i click on that it's going to pop this up and i will click on this session where it said get started so once i click on get started here it's going to click i will download it so now that i've downloaded it the, the next thing i need to do is to go to my um device I think it's device manager. Yes, I'll go to my device manager. So when I go, my device manager is going to open. So once my device manager open here, then what I need to do is to click on this session where you say display adapters. Adapters. So once you click on this session where you say display adapters, it's going to show you the Intel, uh, the Intel arrow here. You can see this Intel arrow uh, iris here. So click on it. And you need to click on it twice, like you click on it just once from your computer. And you see this session where it said update driver. So I will click on update driver. And this session, let me say, for example, um, we want to do it automatically. If I click on automatically, it will automatically show us that it will automatically show us and install the Intel graphic driver on our computer. So let us wait. This is automatically this type of light that is blinking right now. It will blink a light like this. And it will tell you that to see to see show this window has successfully updated your drivers so that is it and what you just need to do is to do close window and that is it so now it will be 555 um graphics so that is it and um, once you are done with that that is how you can do let me say you want to install it automatically that is when you have to use the uh, intel driver support assistant so how you can find that is under your um under this icon here you find it at the bottom here click on it and you will find intel drivers here so what you need to do is to click on the intel drivers at the bottom here so once you click on the intel drivers it will display this so it will display this that is why i told you that you should install this intel driver and support assistant so what is doing is that it helps you to detect every software you want to install and it will automatically display them for you telling you that okay you have one software to update you have to have three if there is any update of all software that is available on your computer so when you can see that we have this software now which is intel graphic driver for windows 10 that is what you want to know how to install this is how you can do it automatically now you have display here what you need to do here is to click on download and once you click on download, it will start downloading the software. As you can see, it's downloading it now. And once it's done, it will tell you to run the software. And once you run it, your you have to turn off your computer and turn it back on again. So let us wait for it to uh, uh, download it completely. So as you can see, guys, it have just been completed and it's telling us to install it. So I will click on install. Yes. And now it's going to install the software for us. 
and all we, all we just need to do is to be patient and it's going to install it and it's going to tell us that progress complete in just a second so it will display this and tell you that okay that you want to install this a uh, new version but the current one is different from this new one so what you can say you can say yes here and once you say yes it will pop this up you just need to click on next and just scroll this down and click on yes and click on next again and here you are just going to accept the terms and condition again